this is Natalie, and we are here with the Artist Connective Influencer Team. And we're here at Eva Scrivo Salon in New York City. And we're here to give you the hot tip of the day. This is Erin Mills, my partner in crime. Hi. So what's your hot tip? So I'm doing a foliage, but I want to make sure that she is very bright around her face and around her hairline. So I wanted to show you guys how I think of the money piece. So the biggest consideration is to think of the entire halo around the hairline, right? And I always want to start with what I want to be the brightest. So the brightest is going to be an inch and a half to two inches around her entire hairline. And when you think of the money piece, you don't necessarily just want to think of, here's my quadrant, here's my quadrant. I like to think of how do I bring the hair all around the head in a circle and, and incorporate every single little piece in the hairline. So even though I'm doing foliage, everything, let's say five to six foils around the entire hairline is either in a thin slice or a weave. And I just did three thin slices here. So I'm gonna start incorporating a weave and then I'm gonna incorporate my shark tooth pattern here too. So what the shark tooth pattern does with the weave is it, it just adds another element of blending. And you know blending is so important and it starts with your pattern, not the toning. So I add on my color and the shark tooth pattern is with my weave going in and creating little teeth marks and since I'm from Florida shark tooth is definitely a good name for that people seem to remember that um, so I have a better blend because I have my weave and my shark tooth and then doing a couple of these and then going back to my foliage will make everything flow together so much better so I have my thin slices then my weave then my shark tooth and then I'm gonna go back into my foliage all the way back to here and do the same thing around the entire hairline. Thank you so much, Erin. We know that's going to come out beautifully. And please give us your handle. Oh, my handle is at Erin.Mills on Instagram. And I'd love to hear from your love some feedback. Perfect. Make sure to follow her. And my handle is bridal underscore by Natalie. Have a great day.